is next. Another heat of the high school boys, four by 400. Walt Whitman from Bethesda, Maryland. Telecommunication from Brooklyn. St. Francis Prep from Fresh Meadows, New York. Walter Johnson from Bethesda, Maryland. Tri-Valley Central from Gramsville, New York. Caroline County from Milford, Virginia. Lindenwood, New Jersey. Blind Brook from Rye Brook, New York. Spring Grove, Pennsylvania. Riverdale Regional from Oradell, New Jersey. Damascus, Maryland. Christo Ray from Philadelphia. Hudson Catholic from Jersey City. Washington Latin from Washington, D.C. Briarcliff out of Briarcliff Manor, New York. And Cardinal Spellman from the Bronx, New York. So this is event number 416. Just to give you an idea of what the schedule looks like today, each individual heat is considered its own event here. And we will be running open heats until event number 441. So still 25 4x4s to go. The top teams are spread out over the last five or six heats. Then we will have the prep school 4x400s. And then we'll have the Philadelphia area 4x400s. That runs all the way up to event number 454 and then event 455 so 40 events from now at 1237 is the 4x100 USA versus the world presented by Xfinity men's race to start off an afternoon of a ton of fun which you can find on NBC Sports Gold and throughout NBC's television coverage as well what's interesting is so many high school kids running the 4x4 here at the Penn Relays I've had an opportunity to coach a lot of high school kids, and none of them wanted to run the 4x4. Four four. <laughs> <laughs> Riverdale Regional out in front at this exchange. And then it's Damascus next. I assume that changes at least at the Penn Relays. You yeah. get a chance to run in front of a crowd like this, but would you say it's because the 400, you know, it's such a big effort that unless you're a 400 runner, it's tough. Like, you, you know, you, you're carry. If you're a distance runner, you, you're terrified to run down to the 400. And if you're a 100, 200 runner, that's a big stretch to go out there and run the 400. Yeah, it, it really is. And, you know, but I think here at the Penn Relays as well is that there's no open events. Yep. So if you're going to come run here, it's either 4x1, four 4x4. By four by four. Particularly at the high school level. The only open high school events are invitationals for the distance events, the mile and the 3,000. There are those college open events, the uh, 100s and the sprint hurdles. Moving into the top spot. It is Damascus, Maryland taking over the lead from Riverdale Regional. So Damascus with the lead at the bell. Got a good leg from John McNeil, and now it's Imundian Ayo Dorage for Damascus. Riverdale turns it over to its anchor, Andrew Sanchez. And now Riverdale's gone right back into the front spot. Riverdale and Damascus in this heat. Trying to beat the time of 324.77 from St. Catharines, Jamaica. Riverdale's Andrew Sanchez out in front as the wind just gusts. You know what makes this 400 even harder? You are finishing into a very strong headwind at this point. Well, the wind is going completely the opposite direction that it was yesterday. That's what's amazing about this is just con different conditions completely. Riverdale through the headwind, pushing, and they are home. Riverdale wins the section. Second place to St. Francis Prep, who finished strong. Damascus finishes third. Waiting for Riverdale's time to pop up. And it is 3.30.58, good for the Fourth best time of the day so far. 335-14 for St. Francis Prep. 336-85 for Damascus. Riverdale closed with its anchor 52-19. They really don't build in much buffer.